Okay. Right. Good evening. I've been given the okay that we're on air for both YouTube and for Facebook. Yes, is that correct? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's just got the new layout and it just feels in a, like the camera's in a different place. Right. Is it okay? Yeah. If it's okay at home. Yeah. Right. Okay. It's all right. It's 7 it's, p.m. Uh, yeah, and it's Wednesday. So it's time for your Strictly Teaching Part 2 uh, with the uh, Caribbean Samba. So we're going to do the sort of the last quarter tonight and uh, give you some more technique. So before we start, as ever, our um, casseroles. House rules, yes, that's it. <laughs> I knew it was lingering I do, somewhere. I do it? listen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that's a bonus. Right, so our house rules. The cameras are definitely further back tonight. Oh. Yeah, so I can let us know at home if they're okay, because they're definitely in a different place. We've been moving things around right, okay. today. So we have been um, moving things around yeah. today and repositioning things. Um, and I've been cleaning the lenses and things, so hopefully they're not frozen tonight. So house rules. Um, if you're going to join us dancing tonight, uh, what we'd like you to do is um, make sure that you move all those pieces of furniture back. The tables, the chairs, the sofas. Um, move them out of the way so you can't injure yourselves or damage anything. Um, also, if you've got anything that might be slippy on the floor that you're dancing on, like a rug or a carpet that's on a slippy floor, uh, on a laminate floor or something like that, make sure they are rolled up or secure. Um, also, if you have pets in the house, make sure that they are secure so that they nor you can either injure each other. Also, uh, get yourselves a drink on the side, which Shanna has ready. Yes. And to there, as ever for all of you, toilets on the left for ladies and gents, which you may well need. So, um, she's looking along and um, she's going to do a little bit of uh, waving to people who will come on to join us. You wave as well. I will. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we've got Mary Kirby from Dublin. Oh, right. Okay. David's on, David, nice and David, early. David. Um, Alison and Trevor are on. All right. Andrew's David. on. Stephanie and David. Bernadette. Mm. Martin and Anna from. Cheryl's yes, well done. <laughs> Cheryl and John are on. Mehdi, Naswithdar from Bangor. Yeah, that's a good yes. one. Uh, George and Renock are on. Oh, Carol, yes. Carol's on. Yes, from the uh, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Brenda and Michael are on from a very damp Dartmoor. Oh, uh, mm. right. Okay. Yes. David and Adele from Penwortham. Mm. Uh, you pronounce that do quite. you know what I was just about to say? If the one thing out of lockdown for me is the fact I can now say the word Penworth just yes. about. Uh, Caroline and Bob have had the central heating on. I know what <laughs> yes. you mean. Add the fire on today. <laughs> Celia from Eastbourne. Oh, yes. Teresa and Trevor from Taunton. TTT. Mm -hmm. uh, Linford and Kathy from a very wet Mac. Macclesfield. But yes. looking forward to a sunny samba. Oh, I like it. Go. Yes. Carol is in Norfolk. Long, long hair Carol yes. down in Norfolk tonight. Is yes, wow, she's there. Right. I'm glad you got there for safe, Carol, because it's a long way. Mm. Uh, Pat and Neil are set to Samba. Cloudy Fife, Heather and Bert. Right. Hi from Alan and Wendy. Linda and Ken from Londonderry. Mm. Francis and Yvonne are here. Good evening. Jeff and Maureen from Newport. <laughs> Andrea from Charmouth, no helicopters so far oh. tonight. <laughs> um, Graham Owen, good evening, everybody. Uh, Wendy Christie from Stonehaven, I've got a couple left. Jack and Barbara say hi. And Claire Morris says hello. Oh, right, okay. That's Excellent. Facebook. Oh, so right. We've got, we'll the YouTube on we've got, we've got more, yeah. Mm. Jilly and Albert from West. Can you believe all these people are doing samba? Normally when I say samba, there's like a, a gentle groan. Mm. It's great. Uh, Julian, yeah, Albert from West Bay. Ian and Liz from Rain Hill. Hill. Yes. Iris Richards. Lindy and Robert are on. Sriani from Durham. Mm. Bronwyn and Brian are ready for a samba. Oh, on, Tom is on from Soggy Seven. That's hard to say. Soggy Seven, seven Oaks. Oaks. Yeah, hard to say that. Soggy Seven Oaks. Hard to say, isn't it? Yes. 
um steve and diane from ludlow oh steve and diane i don't Ooh. think you're on my map because Ooh. i would have I've... i would have remembered ludlow yes ludlow's not cropped up before no and it's I beautiful i love steve ludlow and, and i would certainly oh. have remembered writing you on so steve and diane i'm going to write you on shortly steve and diane you're definitely not no on. we've had nobody from ludlow because it's Unless so beautiful <laughs> yes yeah, yeah, so i'd be on holiday like carol in norfolk oh yeah i could put carol in norfolk yes. <laughs> and marilyn and melvin are here from horsham they had a cornwall cream tea today oh yeah oh pam and jim looking forward to the last steps Excellent. well the last steps it really is a case of we'll be finished in five minutes there's very little on the end, isn't there? Can't quite remember what we got to. We got up to the reverse turn, whisk, side close. close. Ready to so go. We've done okay. Right. We've done three right. quarters. Nice. The two cameras are maybe in a different position tonight. As I said, we've been moving everything around today. So we'll have to let us know if it's all right. It looks all right from behind. But I know they're in a different place because they look different when we look at them, don't yes, they? Yes, they do. Yes. Yeah, it's strange. Okay, are we walking through? Yes. To walk through the beginning. To, to music, up to the promenade position at the end. Then we'll take any questions and then we'll do the last little bit, which we'll do like that. Mm. Remember the first bit? Yeah, just Ah, that's why the so I keep dropping. Yeah, the, the little thing here. Ah, I don't know if you can see here, everybody. Obviously, feels back. It's raining. Yeah, we're pouring down. But I always wear the same thing, so I know which video it is. And this is my this is my part one. What I wore. Mm. So I've worn the same thing. It's freezing now. <laughs> It was all like sandbury and we, we we went through one or two things just before and and, and she rubbed my hand because my hand was really cold and she was really hot yeah within five minutes oh, she yeah. was freezing yeah i do i get out of cold right so our little walk through so we've got our two walks and we're doing the same foot as partner so we're doing our left right and then we've got our crescendo lock step cross step we've got our right foot botafogo step and replace and we've got our point 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 and the botafogo on the left foot botafogo and another point point and then we've got a little turn to face partner step close side close from there we'll keep going we won't come back so it's the reverse turn so one and two three and four from then we did a whisk, a, a long line of dance, a little whisk, and then a side close into promenade position, like so. And that's what we've got up to. So we'll do it once more, once more, without a break. Just walking it through. I count the numbers this time. Ready, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, eight, one, and two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven, eight. Okay, should we try to music? Two goes to music. There we go. So any issues, let us know and we'll have a go through any questions. Oh, we've moved the speaker as well. It's going to turn up a bit. It's a little bit different in the air today. Let me just see this a bit better. Sorry. <laughs> Not again. There we go. Five, six, seven, and one. Boat to First turn, whisk, okay, and again, here we go, five, six, seven, and five, 
Oh, he's off again. <laughs> okay, I'm just double checking in case you've got any comments. Let us know if you're all right at there. Up, a little heart, and everything seems to be okay with that. I can see a few. Yeah, you're coming up already. Moment. Yes. I'm just double checking. <clears throat> got, yeah, Pamela said we're very quiet today. We have moved the speaker, so we might just need to turn oh, it up a bit. Yeah. Right. Okay, so um, just wait, just in case anyone's got any questions. Right. Uh, our last quarter um, is going to be fairly straightforward. Um, we have um, a little sort of zigzag for you, and then a um, sort of a little sort of chassis side close into starting position again. And uh, we'll do that first. We'll go through that, um, get that honed in. And then I am sure um, the good lady here, um, Honeymoon, will uh, sort of start sorting you all out with some technique of that last Yeah, part. a little bit. Yeah, yes. just enough to give yeah, you a little a, sort of little flair. an idea of yes. what you could sort of perhaps try. But it's mm -hmm. very often it's up to the individual as well, isn't it, and your own take on it. And then um, at the end, we shall be telling you what we're doing next, next week. week. So... Mm. We're, we've, we're trying not to repeat any rhythms mm. and introduce something. So even if we sort of reboot the old classic idea, yeah. um, it's still a different rhythm to the ones we've already um, yes. tackled. And next week is a different rhythm again. Well, yeah, Let's yes. see if you can guess what it is. Mm. Mm. Right. So I think we're okay. Yes. Uh, Ian's just said volume seems to be okay on YouTube. I said we've moved everything, so we might just, if it gets a bit quiet, let us know and we'll just turn up a bit. Right, okay. um, so, are we ready for the last quarter? We are. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've done our step close and we talked about turning the feet to a promenade position and we're in a close hold. From here, we're going to do um, a zigzag, um, but it's going to be a different timing within it. So, we're going to step through on the foot nearest partner for a slow. We're still in close hold. We're going to do a side step to face partner for a slow. And then we're going to go into a fall away position. And as you do so, just let this arm slide to double hand hold into fall away. So you end, as you go into the fall away position of the zigzag, you're now in an open hold, a double hand hold. Then you step to the side and then you step through. Okay, I think it's fine in total. I'm not sure I haven't counted. So just that bit. So just the feet, so you're stepping through the middle, to the side, into fall away, to the side, through the middle. Okay, a standard zigzag, a standard mirrored zigzag. So you're both, you're a complete uh, mirror version of each other. So when you step through, so is your partner, to the side, into fall away, to the side, step through the middle. And you want to, if you've never done a zigzag, I know most of you are experienced dancers, just in case there's anybody who isn't, you need this to keep progressing down the room, which isn't the easiest thing to do when we've got such tight space. But if you can, just take little steps. So as long as you keep it moving the same way, forward, side, back, side, forwards. Okay, samba, the rhythm, is going to be... Well, officially it's slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. But are we on a one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are. Yeah. It'll be one, two, three, and four. Okay, if we, if we keep the, the eights, counting the eights. If you like me, you like numbers. So you're second from the one. One, two, three, and four. Okay, and get five steps. Ready, and one, two, three, and four. Okay, hopefully you're doing it really well at home. I know you keep having to move back to do it again. Ready, and slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. Okay, is that all right? I think we'll be fine with that. Uh, and at the end, all the, this is the end, we're going to do a little chassis to finish off. So, I'm probably okay if we just do it together. So it's slow, slow, 
quick, quick, slow. We're going to do side, close, side, and then turn to shadow on the fourth count. So it's side, close, side. We let go. We both turn into shadow position. Lida, you change weight? Um, yeah. Yes. Follow the taps. And we start again. That's all there is to it. So let's just recap that last eight. So we've got a count of eight. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. Should we dance it facing that way? Ooh. Ooh. Should we dance it I'm sidetracked because it all looks different in there. <laughs> you all look different at home. <laughs> Okay, ready, and slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, side, close, side, tap, if you're a follower. Back into shadow. Okay. Let's do one that way, just to make sure. I'm sure you're all practicing at home. Here we go, and, ready, and, one, two, three, and four, Five, six, seven, eight. You okay? <laughs> Didn't think you were going to Really helped. Okay, just in case you've got any questions. Right. So that was the last eight. Yes. And um, it is, as I said a little earlier, it's fairly straightforward, that is. If you've not done that kind of zigzag before, just get that honed in. Because that's the little crux part of it, really. Yes. Um, and once that's there, the rest is, the rest is fairly straightforward. Um, so what if everybody's okay with that, I can see one or two hearts going yeah, up. Yeah, they're so okay. No, if no everybody's questions. okay, we shall dance that to some music. Yes. Yeah. Medi's just said, will it be Mambo next week? Uh, good guess. No. no. <laughs> but a good guess. Okay, so let's do it three times mm -hmm. with music, just that last count of eight. It's not a barn dance. <laughs> Go on, barn dance. Yes. Okay, so let me just know how you are with that last eight. Do yes. you need to have a bit more practice? Are you okay at home? Christine and Angus have just said all good here. Celia said all's okay. Excellent. Brian's given us a little heart. So just need to double check you're all okay before I don't want to move on. See if this is in the class, or we just double check with you. Just are you all okay? Yes, if we're in the class now, actually, what we do is put the music on for a track and a half and let you practice, and we'd then come round and just check everything was okay and have a little chat with you all. Um, but unfortunately, you all live that far apart from each other. We can't get around. Well, if we get in the car now, we can have Yes. Yeah, and the um, likes, yeah, we're okay. All good, Neil Hopkins. Paso, David, no, it's not. We, we will do Paso, we will. but it's, Paso, not, yes. it's not Paso next week. Mm, I like a Paso. Yeah, we like passing. Okay. 
So, um, let's put the whole thing together. Yes, from start to finish. Okay. Shall we go, go with music? Yes. I think we should, don't you? Are we going to go straight down and keep it nice and small? Yeah, we did try this earlier. I mean, the reason I like this samba is because it travels down the room. Mm -hmm. And you really feel like you're, you're using the floor. Mm -hmm. um, but we can't hear, so we're going to take teeny tiny steps. But we can fit it in, can't oh, we? Yes, because we've tried. Yes. So let's give it a go, everybody. If you're game at home. Are you ready? I am. Come on then, let's I'm give it a go. Just yet, I, I know, know, that's why I'm a bit worried. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, I'm just, yeah, I'm I'm on. Let's Here we go. Tiny steps. Here we go. Practice yeah, so yeah. Once you feel okay with that, just give us a thumbs up. Yeah, they're doing all right so far, I think. If you're getting right the way through it, um, and the, the, the routine's in there, that would be fantastic. And then we can start sort of to the latter part of it, just doing that little bit. Uh, yeah, and yeah, and any questions? I think we'll probably have a maybe a shorter session tonight. Maybe. Um, yes. Just, you know. Because we're going to have a little chat about next week anyway. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Um, but yeah, anything you want to know, let us know. Um, Okie dokie. So I'm thinking though, really, what would be quite good is if we kept it going now. So for the, those of you at home with a bit more room, yeah. or just, just so we start it again, because it's always the transition from old to new. Mm -hmm. Still going. Okay. So yeah, it's the old to new, isn't it? So the bit you've learnt before to the new bit, and then starting it again. Yes. So so you you're keeping that. So are we sort of going to do this down? <laughs> I don't know. Should we try and dance it round a circle? Do you think you could follow? No. <laughs> Shall we dance it round in a circle? And yes, if it goes let's... horribly wrong mm -hmm. at home, you just keep going and yes. don't watch us. Mm -hmm. But we'll try and go in a circle. We're going to go round in a circle. Okay, yes. which is quite interesting in shadow position. Because you're almost going to be going backwards in the middle. Yes. All right? Let's give it a go. Yeah. The reason being, even if you're just walking at tiny steps, just so you feel it start again. So we're just, dr we're just drilling it in, really. And this is what we would do in a class, mm. isn't it? Yes. So we are a class. We're just a bit more spread out than normal. Mm. Okay, you ready? <laughs> Come on.
Excellent. How did it go? Let us know how it went. Ooh. Caroline's trod on Bob's foot twice. Oh, right. Well, at least it's, you know, symmetrical. Yes. <laughs> if you're going to do it on one side, do it on the other. <laughs> Let's have a look. Oh, hi, Paul. Paul just come along. Oh, right, okay. Yes. Yeah, transition is tricky. It's always a transition, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And when you get to that third sequence and your brain switches off. Mm -hmm. So you need to get past the third sequence wall, mm -hmm. don't you, in sequence? You do. And you've got it then. Okay, Sue, so, yeah, Sue's all right. Yeah, okay. Okay for Neil. Thank you, it's very clear, Lucy. Yes, I must say, because we've had a very busy couple of days, I've got loads of emails I haven't got back to. Right. So um, it's not that I haven't seen them. I will get back to you all and WhatsApp messages and all sorts of things. So I'm going to go through everything tomorrow. Okay. With another busy couple of days. Mm. Good. Alison and Trevor, loving it. Good. Celia is okay. Timing practice. Yeah, Albert just needs an extension. <laughs> <laughs> to the city. Mm. Good. Pamela says, hmm. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Likely to expand on that. Right. Uh, loving the sound of her Brenda. We're all okay. All right. Excellent. So um, I'm going to grab a quick drink. Um, okay. Are you okay there, Phil? I'm perfectly fine here. Yeah. You're yes. fine? Okay. Do you want a drink? Mm. <clears throat> no, I'm all right. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Uh, okay. So let's have a look. Um, right, so we looked at Samba Bounce, Samba everything is dance ball flat, so you're always going uh, ball of foot first, no heel leads, no, I'm trying to think of any, no heel leads at all, all ball of foot, mm -hmm. and you normally get your weight going forward first, quite a progressive kind of dance, not only around the room, but you feel like you progress with each step, so you're always on to the next step. Um, I feel it's like a 45 degree. I always felt like I'm going up into 45. A little bit of a launch in a samba. Um, but we've looked at the walks. Mm -hmm. We look a little look at the lock. We did a boat of fogos mm -hmm. with a samba bounce. Craig Rebel Horde calls it a double bounce. It's just that even in a boat of fogo, you, you kind of you rise into the one as well. So you have this little launch before the one as well so it's not one a two it's a one a two so you have like a that's what it means when he says double bounce then we did what did we do next um, turn to face reverse turn yes okay we were going to go through this so in a reverse turn in samba let's just move just so you can see your feet in. so um we're going to shape so this, it's got six steps to the reverse turn. The first three are where the leader goes around follower, bigger steps for leader. And the second, four to six, is where follower goes round. So your one, two, three, so the one, two, three, is where the leader gets round. And the four, five, six, is where follower gets round. So this little bit of shaping in a reverse turn, you may do that already, you may not. If you don't, you might like to try it. So on the one, two, three, when I teach the children, um, well, normally there's a car park there, so I normally say look at the car park, but look at wall, okay? So if that's line of dance, always look at the wall, both of you, on the one, two, three. Wall, one, two, three. Okay, so you're shaping to wall. So you're shaping to leaders, left, followers, right, on the two and the three, really, uh, the steps two and three. And then, if we were going to continue, we would shape the other way if we were going to keep going. So if you're going to keep going, the shape change allows you the progression down the room and it sort of sets you up for the next step. If you're not going any further, I would just take it to neutral. So we're only really going to shape in this situation on the first three steps. And just look at the wall. Just think, look at wall, first three steps. And so one, two, three. Bit of a shape change. 
And then we've got our four, five, six. Just look at partner. Four, five, six. If you did that there, it would look a bit odd. Okay, so just back to neutral. Okay, you might want to try that at home. The count, well, I've said the number of steps, that's the number of weight changes, but the actual music is one a two. So we're going to do one and two, three and four. So one and two, look at wall. Three and four, look at partner. Does that make sense? Ooh, okay. Good. Again. Ready? And oh, one, and two, three, and four. Why did you show me my stuff there? <laughs> <laughs> Should we try it one last go? Oh, yes. Should we try it from that end? Oh, we can do. We go ready, and all one, and two, three, and four. Okay, is that all right, everybody? Do you want to try that to music? Should we try that to music? Okay, should we read in the comments? Okay. Just the reverse turn. Just the reverse turn. Without the shaking on the first three steps. Here we go. something it's one of those sort of styling tips you can add in mm -hmm. if you want to it also helps you get around each other as yeah, well it is. um so we've done that bit then we've got the samba whisk yes well what i would say in a samba whisk we talked about the bounce on monday and about trying to keep it down probably the next thing for me would be the samba timing and it's different all the way through um but in a whisk it's well, it's not this. Should I do it sideways on? Yeah. yeah. It's not. Can you hear my feet? Okay, you've got a longer first part. Bam, ba bam, bam, ba bam. It's like swing music. Da, da, da. So if we just play the music, mm -hmm. and I'll just show you what I mean. Oh, I'll do it then. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'll do it for me. <laughs> flavour. Da, da, da. Okay? And then the step close is just to get us ready for the next bit. I'll just slow, slow. Is this to music? Or? It is to music, otherwise it'll seem a bit odd. Yeah, we won't be able to do that. Um, da, da. Okay, shake 
shape change. So it starts to listen to your samba in a slightly different way. So it's not that all the way through, mm -hmm. but um, it does pick up that beat from the music. Yeah, rather than da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. okie dokie. So next bit is the zigzag. zigzag. There's all samba is so strange. It's all different. It's like um, like what's it? Potpourri. It's like something where all bits are putting together. All different flavours, all different rhythms, all different techniques. But I just think if you get this bounce, just think do the bounce all the way through and a little bit of shape changing is quite nice. I don't know why I was going to do it this one. Is that why you stood there? Well, it sounds difficult. I know. I'm going to do this end of it. Yeah. So I want to do the sound. So you can see the sound. So we're in promenade position. Our feet are closed. I've turned it round so we're facing you now. Um, so we're in, we're in close hold for the first two steps, the forward and the side, forward, side. Now, as we go into the um, arm slide, into the fall away position, I really do use this connection here to push myself backwards into there. I know we're gonna have a double hand hold, but I'm really using this one and especially pushing now into the next step. It is <laughs> Depends how strong your follower is. <laughs> Resist. Resistance isn't futile. Okay, so you're going to step through. Slow, slow. So I'm really starting to increase that resistance now. Quick, quick, slow. Okay, so um, the arms. Now, leaders, you're not doing this. Show what you're not doing. I'm not going to dance it with no, as you dance it. Yeah. Oh, right, okay. What we are not doing, okay, we start off like this, okay. Now we're facing, now as we start to come into double handhold, what we're not doing is this. I hate it. Yeah, okay. Don't try and help too much. Leaders, what we're doing is giving our, I look at it this way, is that we're giving our partners a frame, a solid frame so that she can put some resistance in to help her move. So her movement down there relies entirely on us. Yeah. Okay? Because we are <clears throat> leading her. Yeah. <laughs> so the this handhold, we've done this in the some of the other dances as well. See our little line all the way down the middle there. The hands stay on that line and we're kind of equidistant to it in many ways. And it stays there. So if we've kept moving, so if we keep going when we get to the fast ones, hopefully you'll see what I mean. So it's slow, slow. Now keep going. Okay, all the way down. So you're both contributing again to that, um, I don't want to say tension, that compression in the middle towards each other. Resistance there. And it's it's not white, it's not white knuckles. Um, there's a little bit of give in it, but you both need to meet in the middle. So it's slow, slow, da, 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 da. okay? I, <laughs> I always feel like I've got a little, well, I suppose I've got a little one, a little uh, sand dress, a little, you know, one of those feathers or fringes around, and I want to, to flick it as I go. I'm not going to do that because I'm going to the mic. Um, so I try and keep my shoulder line relatively still, and let my hips move a little bit more. And so the guys can do it as well. So rather no, than... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, bring, bring your skirts on Saturday for the guys. Um, so we're actually in this as we go through. So it's slow, slow. So when you get to here, feel as though, we do just really small steps, that my hips are going more. I'm still looking at Phil. I'm quite relaxed at the top. 
Okay, just to make it feel a bit more sambly. I'm using ball of foot only. I might do it on the side. So we'll just go into quick ones, okay? So go through it. So my legs are quite close. And I'm using my leader to, to push against, to get myself getting these little uh, zigzags going down the room. Make sure both feet are twisting. So again, so don't face me. So both feet are twisting. Your legs stay about the same distance apart. Always, they're quite close in a samba. Like that. Okay. Using the ball of foot to pivot. Might be hard on carpet at home. Mm. Anything else with the zigzags? I really feel, feel like you really connect together. It's a connection. Yeah, I mean, we do this whole. Some people do it like this, all sorts of things, but I just feel you need a bit of a push mm -hmm. against your partner. I'll just see if there are any questions. Yes. Make sure it's still running. Have a little practice. See how you feel about okay. that. Okay. Everybody okay? Well, should we try the zigzags to music? Yes. And we'll just keep you just keep doing them down the room. So do two slows and then keep going with the quicks. Okay. And we'll try a couple of times to music. Mm -hmm. Which end are you starting at? <laughs> the same end as you. <laughs> I'll get into position. Then. Good boy, well done. I like it when you get into position. <laughs> Okay, everybody. So, <laughs> yeah. so let's have a go with the shaping in the reverse turn. The whisk timing, just, just starting to feel like a slight, there can be a different timing in samba. And then the zigzag with connection to partner. Okay, here we go. check in with you to make sure it's okay and then we'll just do just a little tiny look at the very last bit mm -hmm. and we'll put it all together so let me know at home did it go okay if you've got any questions just give me the usual feedback and then we'll know right okay um if you are all okay with that we'll just have a look at those last four steps as yeah, such just for that. um and then um, we shall do the whole thing. We'll dance it through um, and just hold it all in. And that will be our samba. Our Caribbean this samba. Yeah, our Caribbean samba for this week. Yeah, we should say it again. It's um, Bev and Barry. Barry's. Uh, won yes. this in, I think it was, years, wasn't it? yeah, 2010. It was yeah. uh, arranged. So they're um, okay. Mm. They're all right at home. And we shall do it again on Saturday night at our oh, Saturday dance. Oh yes, we can't really do a, a Caribbean thing. We did not already, haven't we? Mm. So we'll have to just um, mm. 
Just have a bit of everything, I think. Lots of week, we'll I think. see what we've got coming up next week. Is there anything Yeah, something? I've already thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> Can I give the game away? Right. I wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> no, we're okay. We're all right. Yes. Okay, so just the last bit. What could we do with the last bit? Just to give it a little bit of an extra pizzazz. And again, I'm going to face this way again. I'm so <laughs> we've done our zigzag. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. We've come through the middle with our foot. Uh, oh, double hand hands. Um, all I would say, well, this is um, originally, I think it's merengue action. So remember with the merengue? I said about you, you straight, you use the inside edge, you bend and straighten. So the minute you go into the hip, your other knee is getting ready. Goes into the hip, the other knee is getting ready. Okay, so as you're doing your side, close side, Really try and use a little bit of merengue action as we do it, both of us, leader and follower. We've only got three steps though, so make the most of it. So in fact, we'll do it sideways. So we've gone through the middle. We've finished there. We've just got that little chassis on the end. Just the first three part first. One, two, three. Okay? So you're in inside edge of foot, You've always got one knee bent and one knee straightened. Okay, and that's continuous beats now. You're right, and you're right there. <laughs> Come back. <laughs> so we bend it through the middle. Here you go. And one, two, three. Okay, on the last step, don't turn out too early. We're going to wait until the very last minute so it's nice and sharp. Pop. Back to shadow. So don't, don't use it. I think it's so um, tempting to think, well, I know I'm going back to the beginning. So from the step through, you may well be thinking, to uh, uh, get ready. Don't get ready early. Enjoy the merengue action. So we're going to step through. We've done our zigzag from there. So enjoy that bit then through. Okay. So and leave it. Enjoy leaving Yeah, and then give a little... All you're doing is letting go on that last step where we da, da, da. so followers we're tapping and turning follow leaders we're your, stepping and changing ways so just let it let go catch on okay then you're off again into the beginning again mm. okay mm. so merengue walks on the last section just bent and straighten the legs um and nice sharp ending so you really fill the music, fill the action first on the quick other one, two, three. You've got your inside there, just oh, off we go on four. Okay, shall we do zigzag into that bit? So the last two counts of eight. So zigzag, two slows, then the uh, quick bit. So have a little look, are we okay? No question. Please go through Botafogo. Okay, we'll go with the Botafogo in a second. Okay, righty ho, everybody. Here we go. So, just the um, which bit are we do, Phil? Into the zigzag. Into the zigzag. Yes. I couldn't tell from that position. Okay, yeah. Hi. From the beginning, all the way through. Oh, I have a photo. Oh, photo. Photo. Yes. Not sure which bit is Shiani. Uh, let me know if I don't cover it. 
So to Fogo, you can either go on your left foot or your right foot. Um, what I said, maybe what I said before about you should um, straighten the standing leg and feel like you're progressing over. Feel like it's launching in on the third step as well. So you go, this one is straightening. This this one. So you go. Right one. Yeah, it's the left foot goes further. Yes, but you're straight. Standing you're leg. Right. Yeah, standing leg. Standing so leg. it's going straight as we go over, ball flat. As you put the ball of foot down, you're coming up, switching the foot, heel goes down again. And again, this leg straightens. So you get this, what Craig Rebel Hall would say, a double bounce. Okay, which is the foot. That may mean, because I mentioned it before, that might have been what you were asking. Hope so. Okie dokie. Right, so, are we going to go all the way through? Yeah, we are. We're going to keep go, going? We're going to go around the room again, yes, sir. So from tonight, we've all got the double, we've got the bounce. We've got the shaping in the reverse turn. We've got the, the slightly different timing. It's useful to try it in a whisk, first mm -hmm. of all. We've got the resistance on the zigzag, and we've got the merengue. merengue action at the end. It's a great little routine to try all these different styling issues, isn't it? All righty. Yes. Here we go. Here we go, everybody. Tomorrow, yes. looking through them, I'm making lots of notes. notes for it. Yes, and um, next week, next week, we've got a real beauty. Next week, she got me. <laughs> We're gonna do gavotte, and it's not any old gavotte. It's not Wedgwood Blue. No, <clears throat> it's David's gavotte. Mm. Yeah, I might say this wrong. Grand Florida. I can't say it. Floridan, Floridian, Florid, I don't know how to say it. Grand Floridian. Floridian, is that right, David? 
But I think it's the hotel. I think it's based on hotels. Mm -hmm. So that's, David will let us know anyway. So any tips, I'll just forward them to David. <laughs> <laughs> but this is his winning inventive. I think it was from Blackpool, wasn't it, last year? October. I think he won at the Secrets Festival. Mm -hmm. David let us know. <laughs> Uh, so we're not going to do any old gavotte. We're going to do the best gavotte there is, and that's David's gavotte, that one last now year. this gavotte are full of technique. Yes, but mm. it's a, quite a lot to get through yes. in two nights. So we will do our very, very best mm. next week for you to get through it all. Mm. But uh, so wonderful, elegant mm. uh, yes. dance next week. Oh, yes. Don't worry if you're on carpets. Mm. If we get the steps in, that's all I'm hoping for. It's probably a, a new dance for some of you. Maybe you yes. don't know what it is. Mm. But I'll tell you now, it's nice and slow and graceful. Well, okay, is, if you like slow and graceful, this is the dance for you. It is, yeah. Yeah, uh, Gabot danced really well. It looks absolutely beautiful. Stunning. Yes. Um, I think one year Dan had done a few tours of Gabot, didn't we? We have done a Gabot. And there was many older men not have done a Gabot before. Yeah, that's so right. So enjoyed it. Yes. Yes, they still they said they've forgotten it now. They forgot the gavotte. Mm. Mm. Yes, but it doesn't matter. We will give it a go again. Mm. Yes, next week, Monday, Tuesday. So next week, Monday, Wednesday. Monday, Wednesday. Yes, <laughs> but you can do Tuesday. Do Tuesday, 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 Tuesday. Yes, um, so we're going to do the gavotte yeah. next week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Saturday, of course, we should be back here at six forty-five on Saturday evening for our Saturday night dance, which we will be doing samba. Yeah, I did wonder if you fancied it. We're going to practice all of the normal dances, not this Saturday. This Saturday is going to be a good old practice, but the following one, the Gavotte Week, mm -hmm. whether we just put a sprinkling of some of the old time dances in, yes. something like the Lilac Waltz, mm -hmm. maybe the traditional Viennese again, but maybe one of like Boston Two Step, maybe mm -hmm. do a two step. So maybe just a sprinkling. And uh, who knows, we might so have a little we'll dress up. Get your tails and white gloves on. Yeah, we might just so we make it a special yes. one. Yeah, yeah. and special. have some quiz or other. Oh, yes. Game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For the prize. Mm -hmm. Zoomers, we shall see you on Friday yes. evening at 7, or just before 7 p.m. So, um, have you got videos to look at before? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, they're well. all coming in. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So, um, and ballroom again, if you want to join us for the ballroom mm -hmm. from the 31st of July, let me know. One or two have already said they're quite interested. Okay. So mm -hmm. let me know about that as well. I'll start organising that really from next week. So uh, it just leaves us to say um, stay well, stay healthy, stay dry. <laughs> um, I was out in the rain yesterday walking and um, I waterproofs on, but the headphones open. Yeah. And I just lashed it down. But it was just lovely walking in the rain. Uh, so, we shall be back um, Saturday night, Friday, the Zoom is. So, from uh, us, us to, you. to you, good night everybody and take care. Bye, take care. Goodbye. Yeah. See you all soon. Very well done with that sound everybody.